Hi, Mark Downey here from the Visual Studio team. We're getting really close to the official launch of Visual Studio 2022 on November 8th. Over this preview cycle, we've made some incredible improvements to Visual Studio scalability and productivity, along with making it the most personal and customizable Visual Studio yet. I'm talking about 64-bit goodness for large solutions, more hot reload magic, AI-assisted whole line completion, and just a ton of really good features. We also want to make sure you're best prepared for our latest releases, which includes both a release candidate and another preview, Preview 5. Stick with me just for a couple of minutes and I'll get you the details you need. We will be celebrating the official launch of Visual Studio 2022 with a virtual event on November the 8th. This will be where you can learn all about the latest capabilities, features and tools directly from the Visual Studio PMs and engineers working here at Microsoft. In almost every case, these features have been designed with input from you, the developer community. So I'm going to list a few of my favorite features and it has to, for me, begin with scalability. I'm talking about 64-bit goodness. With the new 64-bit platform, Visual Studio is now capable of scaling to make use of all the system resources you have to improve the reliability of Visual Studio, especially when working with complex solution or using Visual Studio over long periods of time. As a production diagnostics nerd, I am now opening super massive memory dumps in the order of 20 or 30 gigs. Finding file speed has improved dramatically. We all have that one project that has grown to include thousands of files, and I spend a lot of time simply searching for information buried in a project. Searches are now up to three times faster. We have made updates to the AI engine in Visual Studio so that you can predict and complete up to a whole line of code. In this example, I'm trying to update the set password action on the manage controller. I'm quite used to seeing IntelliSense prompting me with what normally amounts to a list of general suggestions. More recently, we developed AI-assisted completions with a star next to them. Now, when I type, you get to see gray text. We have improved traditional IntelliCode experiences to now complete up to a line of code at once. I can quickly and easily accept this suggestion by hitting tab and then tab again. I already have the tab completion muscle memory in Visual Studio, so this fits perfectly for me. I can complete another line by typing return. It gives me another completion proposal inviting me to return the view. It understands my context. We have been adding hot reload to even more developer scenarios, and that now includes CSS. Visual Studio now applies the HTML and CSS changes to the browser immediately. So if I want to experiment with layouts over, say, a simple list, I can quickly paste in and iterate and tweak my CSS. Dependent breakpoints is a highly requested feature that allows you to enable a specific breakpoint only after hitting another breakpoint. This is perfect for those scenarios where you're looping over code, but a conditional breakpoint relies on something out of scope or that exists in another page or class. We will have a release candidate and simultaneously another preview. Installing the release candidate of Visual Studio 2022 will automatically align you with the upcoming general availability release scheduled for November 8th. The general availability or GA version is fully supported by Microsoft and comes with a Go Live license. So you'll want to install the release candidate if your intent is to have a fully licensed version of Visual Studio to build production ready software. Alternatively, you can install the Preview 5 release. This will allow you to try out the latest features of Visual Studio. At the November launch, Preview 5 versions will update to the 17.1 Preview 1 version, and you can continue receiving and testing our latest features. This is just a small sample of the features and tools you can expect from Visual Studio 2022. For more details and updates, please join us for our virtual release event on November 8th.